Ladies and gentlemen, this is your super duper host with the most here. You don't like it is team right, right listeners. How are you doing on this cold edition on the series edition? And I'm doing very well. I hate this type of weather, but we expect it is now official winter. Well, technically yesterday was the first day of winter. This is the second day of winter, but it still sucks. This could probably be a long winter. Hopefully, that's not the case. But no further ado with that mumble jumble. I will discuss for you my lovely listeners wrestling news wrestling topics and a lot of interesting topics to discuss for you so sit back relax be your feet up grab some and eat grab some and drink now if you don't do that maybe you want to look at villain and hear my thoughts and opinions on a certain topic and the article will be down below let's roll it now how am I gonna say this okay TNA Impact However, you want to say this, bless the company. But anywho, the original PW Insider has more details on the deal between Impact Wrestling and the Pursuit Channel. I never even heard a darn channel before. That was announced yesterday. Impact was debut on the network on Friday, January 11th at 10 p.m. Eastern Time. Okay. Now, I don't think I have that channel, Pursuit Channel. What a very bizarre name. It's got to be like a knockoff channel. Like, it's not very popular like USA Network or NBC, CBX. Or ESPN those networks and probably there's other networks out there but and Fox you know those are the very popular ones this one I never heard of it's got to be a very very low budget uh, channel okay impact seeing the move as the friction benefits probably messed up the word apologize and the network is said to be happy to have the, the product you guys can read the rest of it now okay um, let me just fast forward a little bit impact is pleased with your relationship with pop TV I think I have that channel yeah I do sources said there were they that they went from a better deal, a violent, a violence when they started to get paid a free by network around one million a year. Wow. Okay, I'm just gonna skip this. Uh, let's see here. Uh, you guys can read the rest of it. Okay. If you have direct TV new channels after leaving Spike TV in 2014 Pursuit was starting in 2018 as DirecTV exclusive channel. Ooh, okay, so Direct TV was a exclusive channel back then. I don't have Direct TV anymore. Said in June that they had seven million viewers in 2018. So I I guess the only way you could watch it I don't know, I don't know so maybe it's on Dish but you got probably I'm assuming that you got to pay for like a special sports package that is kind of ridiculous um, it's all about the networks if you have a cable network or Dish network it's all about they make an extra money now do you think this is gonna be a good move for TNA or Impact Wrestling or do you think it'll be a bad move what's your thoughts don't shoot the messenger I'm just the host now 
like I said before, I never heard of this darn channel. It's gonna be a very, very low budget one. It's not like like NBC, CBS, Fox, uh, ESPN, and USA. Those are the ones that I know of. You know, you know. Probably this is the only deal they can afford. They can't go on USA because USA is dealing with Raw and SmackDown currently. You know, until SmackDown goes to a different home and there'll be Fox. In you know, Fox. Don't want nothing to do with um, with uh, TNA Impact or however you know. So that's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna wrap this up. Like, subscribe, leave a comment, hit the notification, hit the subscribe. The article will be down below. I don't know if anyone still watches Impact Wrestling or um, other stuff. You know, I don't watch it as much. I keep forgetting now what night is is on. It's not as good in my opinion, like the good old days. So, I want your honest opinion. Do you think this is the end of the road for Impact Wrestling or TNA? Or do you think they're going to bounce back big time? I was just wondering. Have a good one. I want your thoughts on this article. Your honest uh, thoughts, please. And thank you very much for all my um, listeners who commented on some positive feedback. I'm glad you like my stuff I've been doing. Thank you. Later.